Welcome to the USA Pavilion. My name is Ben Gerard. I'm one of 120 US college students selected to represent our country here at World Expo Milano 2015. Here at the USA Pavilion, we have two slogans that we like to introduce to all the passerby or the visitors of the World Expo. The first being one in nine billion, as you can see behind myself. This is the idea that statistically showing by 2050, we will be nine billion people in the world. 35 years from now, another two billion. So it's really put into perspective that, you know, that short amount of time and a lot more people to come onto the same earth as us. Behind me, as you can see, we have a wooden boardwalk. This is uh, wood from Coney Island that we have refurnished, remilled after its destruction in 2012 from Hurricane Sandy. Hi, I'm Angela and I'm one of the student ambassadors at the USA Pavilion. Here is President Obama greeting visitors and letting visitors know how we are each one in nine billion in contributing to the goal of feeding the ever-growing population in a healthy and sustainable manner. Hi, my name is Jack and I'll be explaining the vertical farm which you can see behind us. The advantages of this system are that we can produce food in an urban environment and bring food closer to people who might otherwise not have access. We use less energy transporting food and we're able to reduce water usage by 70 to 90 percent. We just think this is a really exciting technology to be able to bring us into a future where cities are more sustainable, more ecological, and more beautiful for everyone. Hello, my name is Brooke and I'm one of 60 student ambassadors currently working at the United States Pavilion here at Expo Milano 2015. I'm going to quickly introduce the six pillars that we have on the floor. They represent different sectors of the United States which are currently working to battle food security issues that are plaguing the world. And we have experts from industries like farming and industry and agriculture all sharing their expertise on ways that we can combat food security problems. Hi, I'm Evelyn Hill, and this is our game at the USA Pavilion to demonstrate how all of our pillars work together for the overall solution to global food security. It's a really fun way to show people how all of our different pillars work and how they can provide different solutions for all the many different problems in global food security. I'm Elena, and I'm standing in front of the Great American Foodscape at the American Pavilion at Expo Milano 2015. The Great American Foodscape is a series of seven short videos that explain American food, because most people don't know what American food is, even Americans themselves. And the truth is that American food has influences from all over the world. One of the most important of these influences, in my opinion, is the Italian influence. And as an Italian-American, one of the videos really appeals to me, in which they explain how the spaghetti and meatballs combination became so popular. And I think everyone who comes to Expo can find something in the American foodscape which really appeals to them as well. Hi, this is Fosco. Welcome to the American Regional Room. Here we showcase the diversity of American regional cuisine. All these pictures showcase different plates and different places where we eat in the United States. And this is the best room where we can engage with visitors, asking them what they visited of the United States and what they've eaten, and tell our own stories and what our own home cooking is. Hello, I'm Casey, and I'm a student ambassador here at USAP. This experience for me has been one of the best three months of my life, and getting to meet all my new coworkers that are some of the most fun, amazing people to work with. And we've had just some incredible experiences, including a lot of very cool VIP visits. Our first week, in fact, uh, we were joined by Nancy Pelosi in a congressional delegation, and we're able to show her around the pavilion, which is a really cool experience. And then just this past week, we had Secretary John Kerry visit as well. And so we've had so many great people come and visit, and we've been happy to really share the pavilion with them and to get to show them all the incredible things that our pavilion has to offer. Um, to end our virtual tour, we're up here on Terrace right now. As you can see, it's a very busy place with lots of different things to see. We have a bar here and a beautiful view of Expo all around us. So it's a really great place to come up and relax for our visitors that have already seen everything below. We also do the Terrace Talks, where we have different guests that come in and give speeches about future of food or sustainability and things like that to give our visitors yet another opportunity to kind of learn something about food and cuisine around the world. Anyway, we really enjoyed uh, having you on the tour today for all those people who weren't able to join us here at Expo, but we really hope you've enjoyed the virtual tour. Tour, time to get an overall feel of how awesome our pavilion truly is.